Well, sometimes we don't we don't go too much uh, deep because we are still going making wider. So this is the time we are making it deeper because we are almost at the edge of how we can make it big. Like you have one shovel here uh, working in, in making in going deep, and another one making the pushback going. But we would say. In the past five years, we went about 35 meters deep. That's a good number. We started with mechanized mining in 82. In 82. It was a drag line. It's a more rustic machine. We have it here yet. Uh, used to get all the mud and everything. This was a very wet uh, area. So we had no control of the mineralization. We had the mud coming and everything together, mixed waste and stones and everything, and sent to the processing plant. In 1985, we bought our first hydraulic shovel. And it was fun, because uh, when my grandfather went to, to Caterpillar to buy the first shovel. It was a very new machine or something here in Brazil was something only big people used to buy. And the guy said, no, I need to try to help. Say, what are you gonna do with this machine? Said, Not a mine, it's mineral. So we might sell you something more proper, smaller, cheaper. Say, don't worry. I had already my calculation. I'm gonna pay it with a month of work. <laughs> so that time mining was very easy and cheap because it's everything above the ground just coming with the shovel and putting the plant and the emeralds were there. Now we have a lot of job. But that time I said, don't worry, payback is gonna be very very soon. In one, one month I'm gonna pay the machine and no need to make any calculations. Have a good old time. The next open pit is already planning to be in the north. We have pit one, two, and three. One is being finished. Two is being finished. It's it's uh, it's stopped. It's not finished. It's stopped, waiting to be expanded by the 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 new area we have to mine. We have to cut the trees, and we have the third pit that is very close to Cana Mine. Even we call that area Mané Gomes. Is an, uh, there is a new name, it's a bit far from here. 500 kilometers, 500 meters. Out of 11 ton mines, one ton is ore. Out of one ton, we have two grams of rough. Out of the two grams, we have two carats of emerald. So I need to mine 11 tons to have a ring of two carats. This is only on the open pit. In the underground, we don't have this relation. We, we, we don't remove this kind of waste. It's like one to one. One ton of reaction, one ton of ore, and one ton of waste. So it's why open pit is much more, it's, 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 it's becoming more and more expensive. This is, a, this is the waste, going to the waste pile. So we have a waste pile down there. We, yeah, we're just recovering planting again and making, it's gonna be like a hill. Like a, in, in, if you see, if we go there, you're gonna see just the places where trucks are mining, you can see uh, earth. Where we, we have made the pile already, it's all green already. We plant everything. And... So we are, we are 
removing waste or taking the overburden out. Um, we are on top of the ore, so the whole ore in this area is ready to be mined. And we are doing the same thing there. If you see just under the machine, you have the black schist or the phlogopite schist. So we are about to take all the white material that's uh, a kind of granite out, removing to the reaction to the to the, the waste pile. And we later on we will blast all the black rock and take to the plant. The weather phlogopite, here you can see, it's really not the phlogopite, but works exactly the same. This is another kind of schist. This is what we call um, uh, false, false ore. You know what I mean? Like the full gold. It's, you look, some people, they may think we can find emerald in this kind of schist, but this is not the proper schist. This is a very, uh, silica rich schist this is not the one we look for but the weathering layer we can see here is exactly the same when it's weathered it's goldish can you see when it's hard it's black a lot of stones from the top of the valley also came to this area so it was much richer than just having the flow of it's a kind of alluvium right? it did not reach the 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 river yet otherwise it was gone like many of many stones were destroyed by the river you know mechanic of the the, the emerald is not a strong rock so it was all breaking down so we we had a deposit here so kind of placer so he could reach a richer zone